First one is a commutative property. It states that when x of t is linearly convolved with h of t, that is same as h of t is linearly convolved with x of t. That is nothing but a into b is same as b into a. Similarly, in case of discrete time signal, x of n is linearly convolved with h of n. That is same as h of n is linearly convolving with x of n. To prove this, let us take the proof of this. That is, let us take y of n equals to x of n is linearly convolved with h of n. You know the convolution sum formula that is summation of k tends from minus infinity to plus infinity x of k into h of n minus k. Put m is equal to n minus k. When k is equal to minus infinity, when k is equal to minus infinity, m will become plus infinity. When k is equal to plus infinity, m will become that is minus infinity. From this, you can write that that is k is equal to e. k equals to n minus m. That is, you can write y of n equals to summation of m tends from minus infinity to plus infinity x of n minus m into h of m that can be written as summation of m tends from minus infinity to plus infinity h of m into x of n minus m here if you replace m by k it will be same as k tends from minus infinity to plus infinity h of k x of n minus k this is same as h of n is linearly convolved with x of n and so it is proved here similarly in case of continuous time signal y of t equals to x of t that is linearly convolved with h of t this can be written as y of t equals to integral of minus infinity to plus infinity x of tau into h of t minus tau into d tau put that is t minus tau has m that is put m is equal to t minus tau you can write that is that is integrate this with respect to sorry differentiate with respect to dm that is you will get dm by d tau is equal to minus 1 you will get d tau is equal to minus dm you can write y of t has integral of minus infinity to when t is minus infinity this will become plus infinity and this will become minus infinity and whereas that is tau can be written here that is from this we can write tau has t minus m that is x of t minus m into h of m into minus dm next this can written have that is y of t e equals to y of t equals to minus sign is outside integration of infinity to minus infinity that is x of h of m into x of t minus m dm okay this is m integration limits can be changed that is you can write this is integral of minus infinity to plus infinity outside minus sign will come that minus of minus will become plus this can be written as integral of minus infinity to plus infinity h of m that is x of t minus m into d m dm if you put that is m as tau it will become Replace m by tau, it will be that is integral of minus infinity to plus infinity h of tau into x of t minus tau into d tau. This is nothing but that is h of t is linearly convolved with x of t, and this commutative property is proved.